Hello gaming enthusiasts and players across the internet, it's NESGamer345, and welcome back to another Mario Kart 8 online video. So, it's been about five months since we did the last video of an actual episode. Um, the Wii U Mario Kart Thunderbridge Finals does not count as a video. So yeah, five months, it's been quite a long time. The last video did, we did was 200cc races. Did pretty well, but now we're going back to 150cc regional, so. Just, it's been a while since I've played Mario Kart. It's been a few months, so it might be a little bit rusty. Uh, my combination is the me, uh, the P-Wing, Azure Wheels, and the MKTV Paraglider. So, how well will I do without any months of racing? Well, we're going to find out just now. Alright, um, I have not been playing much, so my VR, I mean, my VR is quite high, and I have the second highest in the room. It's the first Mario Kart video and the first Mario Kart episode of the year, and also this month in March, so I'm about two months late for this video. But hey, we're here right now, let's have some fun. So I'm all the way back in 11, this is not the best position to be. I made up half the grid just now. I got a coin. I up in second, third, going back down places, going off the ramp, and grab. I'm in first, second. All right, back in first for the first time, going on this long left-hander. Doing very well so far. The shell almost got me, but no worries. I'm fine. I'm gonna go on the chicane right here. All right, back in gear. Lap one is complete. Lap two, I am currently in the lead. Gonna go in another chicane. Gonna go off the ramp. Um, Luigi is very wild right behind me. I don't know what else I can do. All right, gonna go to a left-hander right here. Going into the left-hander again. Oh, I got hit. All right. I just need to make up this position right now. I'm doing well, I just need to get back in the first. Alright, someone came right behind me, I think it was Donkey Kong. I don't know who it was, but I knew I got he hit my shell. Alright, last lap, that guy just dropped a banana. He has another one in his possession. Going to another chicane, holding my green shell. Did he get hit? The guy saw him stuck. Oh, the boomerang. Oh, red shell. Oh, God, hope he's not sending another red shell. Ha, almost missed that. All right, I am not going to be able to make up to that first place, but second place is okay. Now it's good for three months of not playing Mario Kart, so you have to give it to that. Second place is not that bad. My VR is going up. That's what we want, so. That's nice. Alright, so we're just trying to get back to the room to select tracks. Alright. Big Blue, here we go. I'm excited to get back, although people have different consensus to race on Cheese Land. Don't get me wrong, G-Line is a pretty good track, but I prefer Big Blue any day. It's Big Blue, so here we go. Into the second race of the episode. Now keep in mind, I'm still running for the 20-minute limit. Um, I'm always going to be doing that unless if it's, necess if it's necessary because of battery or whatever. I'm going to keep it at 20 minutes. Alright, starting on pole position for the second race. Just don't mess up the start. And off the starting grid we go. We have a booming lead, but although I just lost it. Alright, I'm right behind um, Dark Matt and Bernie. We're gonna go up here. I just lost my shell, but it's okay. Now Magnus is already folding out on the on the circuit. I'm already back down in 8th, but it's okay, I can make up the positions. 
Alright, back in fifth, very slowly. Alright, I thought that Mitchell was coming behind me. I am not very good with the boomerang. I'm just going to take up this little shortcut here. To go back into fourth place right now. I only made a one position. Alright. We grab an item box going on the tunnel on the way to the third section of the course. Here we go. Oh, people are getting hit. Oh, man. Alright, positions are changing drastically. I have a piranha plant. I'm just going to use this to build up some speed right now. Back in third place. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it this episode, or this race. Oh my gosh, it is a clo it's going to be a close finish. It is no use. I have the lead. I'm going to win the second race. I have to say that last couple turns we had a pretty good battle. I did it. Finish ahead of Butt Sniffer and Bernie. Very creative names, guys. There we go. Finally got a win. Alright, let's see. Hyrule Circuit. Now I see a couple people over there leaving the room. So there has been a lot going on when I'm not doing YouTube. Um, yesterday on Friday, um, by the time I'm recording the video, um, this is on a Sunday by the way, um, I competed in a Smash Bros tournament. I did very well. I made it into the semifinals. Uh, I got knocked out. And this was at my school. This is like a fundraiser thing. 50 people showed up. I was in the top eight, so I did very well. And I'm gonna bring back Smash Bros, because I miss doing Super Smash Brothers a lot. Maybe not online, maybe Melee or Project M, so who knows, that'll be coming your way hopefully soon. And also Spring Break is coming up shortly in a couple weeks, so that will be very good. Now I didn't pay attention to what course was chosen, so we're going to find out. Oh, it's Hyrule Circuit. Again, pole position again because I just won the race. Alright. I got a pretty good start, pretty good boost. Going into the chicane right now. I'm going to go grab an item box. Going off the ramp and into a long right hander. I got a banana, so that will keep me for protection. Bernie is right behind me. Alright, gonna go into the left hander going into the temple. Oh that green shell had almost hit me. Alright, so the um the ramp over there of Seeker Ramp has been opened, so people are now gonna go through before it closes. Alright, I'm currently in the lead, gonna go into the second lap in first place. I got Bernie behind me with a banana. So I have to be careful I don't hit that if he throws it. I got a blooper. That's not going to do anything to me. I can see pretty well. Alright, off the ramp. I forgot to do my uh, little move to get a boost, but it's okay. I have 10 rupees. I got a banana. I'm in the lead on the second lap. I'm doing pretty well. I thought there was a red shell coming behind me because I saw its icon, but never mind. Going into a hairpin right over here, going into a left-hander, then in a right-hander, in the lead for the third and the last lap. Oh, that was very close encounter. No! I have to get rid of it. Oh gosh, okay, I got a shell, it's okay. Nothing's too destroyed. This is just now nerve-wracking. But although I have a pretty good lead at the moment. I have to think of something very quickly. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I oh, sold me out. Now, did the red shell be avoided or something? I don't know what happened. But I know there's no red shell there. Going into the hairpin, going into the left-hander again. 
and in the right hander. And in the lead, off the ramp, on the straightaway, third, the third race is my victory again. Two wins. Nice, nice job. Very good race. We're halfway through the episode. We're making pretty good time. I, Bernie's VR is very high. All right, let's see what courses are coming up this race. All right, Excite Bike, Mute City, Mute City. Ah, oh, why not Mute City? Because Mute City is a very cool course. I mean, I would choose it. Now, two people are choosing random. Two people are choosing the Electro Dome. I'm the only one that chose Mute City. Excite Bike, it is. It's a pretty good, it's an exciting course, although it's, I think it's the most boring course because it's a loop, but of course that's how it was in um, the original NES game, although it was not really a loop, it was just a continuous track, but this is also continuous, so we're waiting for everyone to be connected. Here's a countdown. Alright, that's a pretty good boost for the lead on the start. Going on the ramps, um, they're random every time, so they will always change. But the challenge does not ever change. Do well, be in first, and you'll be good. I'm gonna do my little fire hopping. I'm not the best at fire hopping, even though I've not done it in a few months. Why not try? Red shells are already coming out on the first um, lap of the course, already halfway through the circuit, so. Alright, going into hairpin here, right over here. On the ramp, on the straightaway, again, for the second lap. Almost two red shells. There's a banana right there. Now that guy has a mushroom, he's gonna probably use it very soon. Yeah, right there. I'm going to have to sacrifice my banana for another power-up. Ah, oh, it's the same one. What? I had a freaking banana. Alright, where did that red shell go? I'm kind of curious. Oh, uh, no, there, there it is. I'm going to... You know what? I'm going to go for it. Final lap. All right, I just need to get something very good so I can be in contention. All right, that guy has banana. I just need like three red shells or three mushrooms and I'm good. Oh gosh, okay. I cannot see, I am a blind man. Going on the ramps, I can't see. I don't have any power up. Although there is a man with three mushrooms coming on the rear of me, so. Alright, come on, get something good. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get him. Cause he is just too far ahead. Alright, second place is always good. Just turn down the volume. Alright, two second places, two um, victories. Pretty good so far. We haven't had any um, bad uh, finishes yet. Hopefully not for the episode. All right, 14 minutes in, doing good. 64 Rainbow Road. Now, I don't understand. I know there's like one other person that's just gonna choose Rainbow Road. I mean, all these are great courses. They are fantastic and great to drive on. It's just the problem is, it doesn't suit everyone. Nope, it's not gonna be 64. It's Wild Woods. Alright, sweet, I have the highest VR in the room. That's pretty that's pretty nice. Alright. Here we go, starting in second place in an anti-gravity area. Oh, I had a little bit of a delay, but it's okay, I'm in the lead right now right off the bat. 
I'm gonna go on this section. Now. Good thing I have a shell. The item boxes are not selling me out yet, and that is a good sign. Alright, off the ramp with the paraglider going into the fast water section. Just gotta keep in the middle so I can go fast. Now I'm gonna go on the ramps. Um, up all three boosters going into the chicane to come onto the straightaway and lead the race going into the second lap. Alright, here's lap two. On the first corner, on the first bend. We're gonna go into this section of the tree. I'm surprised. I mean, I don't want to become like a realist or anything. I'm surprised that nothing has set on fire. Because there's flames coming out of the exhaust of the, of the carts. You know, they're doing a pretty good job. Maybe it's all flame retardant. But hey, it's just a video game. By right, going in the fast water section, keeping my momentum through to go on the ramps and stay out of the mud. Gosh dang it. Gosh dang it. Um, Danky Kane's right behind me. Um, now I'm losing my position again. Third place, okay, we gotta have something good happen here. Come on, don't sell me out, item boxes. Gosh dang it. You just wasted your own bomb. Now I'm back down in six. Okay. Ah, uh, red show, red show, red show. This is not looking too good. I'm gonna wait until we're back on it. Uh, back in fourth place. Not in the position I like to be. Fifth place, oh my gosh, we lost it. Alright, that's a pretty bad finish. Fifth is not good. But it is at least in the top half. Alright, so we're gonna do one more race before I sign off, so hopefully we can have a better result. Alright, we just need to have something good happen here. Boom, Neil Bowser. Any day, come on. Neil Bowser has to be at the track. Although it's not looking like that. <laughs> Damn it. Come on, Neil Bowser. No. This is like the easiest course course ever. Except for Babyland Park. That's a pretty easy course, but come on. Neo Bowser is a really great course. All right, here we go. This is, this is it. Gotta make a count. I'm gonna do an early boost right here. I just took her out. There we go. Oh, it's madness right behind me. Alright, I, I just need to stay consistent. Oh, gosh, dang it. You sold me out. Sold me out, item boxes. Oh my gosh, I'm already back down in seven, but this is only the first lap. Oh my gosh. I'm back over here, back in fifth place. To stay away from the bomb, from the bomb. Uh, oh my gosh, it's invincibility. Now people are just going everywhere. I'm not able to make up many positions. Oh my gosh, come on, stay on the track. Oh my, this is just madness. I destroyed his shell. My invincibility is coming on close. Oh, it's gone now. 
I sent two red shells. This has to do something. Alright, come on. I just need to pass this guy. I know there's no way I'm going to win the race. Alright, third place. That's it. That's the best I could do. At least I got two wins this episode, so that's not all that bad. Well, that does it for this episode of Mario Kart 8 Online. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, Super Smash Brothers will be coming back. I don't know what I'll be doing. Maybe Smash 4, Project Dem, or Melee. You will not, you will not know until I do it. Um, Splatoon will be coming out soon. I just need to find more time to do the videos. But hey, at least I'm able to do one, so I can be clarified as not a dead channel. So, um, I'm gonna leave the room. So, thank you for watching, everybody. Please comment, subscribe. Um, follow me on Facebook and Twitter. The links are in the description below. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. Um, if you want to race online with me, um, tell me, and I will uh, message you my Nintendo ID. Or, the best thing I will do is put it in the description below. So, if you want to race me, my Nintendo Network ID is in the description below. So, go ahead and check that out. Have a great gaming experience. I will see you guys in the next video. Take care, everybody.